Hello all, welcome to Binary Programming. In this video, we will solve the first challenge of Big Object Basics module of Developer Intermediate. The name of the challenge is Get Started with Big Objects. Let's move to the challenge. So in this video, we have some theory questions. Let's solve the first one. Up to how many records can a big object hold? 100, this is false. 1000, this is also false. 100,000, this is also false. 1 million, this is also false. 1 billion or more. So yes, E is the right answer for the first one. If you go here, you can see that big objects provide consistent performance for a billion records or more. So E is the right answer for the first one. Let's move to the second one. What is a good use case for a custom big object? Short term storage of transaction data, this is false. Keeping track of transactions between big objects, standard objects and custom objects, this is also false. Keeping track of opportunities, this is false. Maintaining a historical archive for analysis or compliance purposes. So yes, D is the right answer for the second one. Let's move to the third one. What is the best way to query big objects if you are working with an extremely large set of data? SOQL, this is false. SOSL is also false. Async SOQL. So yes, C is the right answer for the third one. Let's check whether we have done it correct or not. So yes, we have completed this challenge and got 100 points for it. See you guys in the next video with a new challenge. Thank you.